Thank you for joining us here at 9 o'clock. We want to get right to some breaking news out of the city of Upland. That's where we find that three people have died after a plane crash into a hangar. KTLA's Annie Rose Ramos is live at the scene with the latest breaking details. Annie Rose, what do we know so far? Well, Lauren, I'm standing right outside of Cable Airport, and we understand from the police and fire department in San Bernardino County that the call came in at around 6.40 a.m. That is when a plane apparently crashed into the hangar you see behind me, causing a fire. You can see and make out some of those fire trucks right there, emergency services and personnel. There's another fire truck in red, that Red Explorer. All of them responding to this one hangar. And I want to bring in Kevin Bunk because you live just down the street and you were telling us that this particular hangar belongs to a learning flight school. Is that right? Yes, ma'am. It's about 630 and I heard a very loud noise sound like a, a truck hit a building really loud. Thought what what is that? But then I heard all the sirens and um, apparently the building caught fire and um, I haven't had a chance to look at the scene yet, but I talk to these flight students all the time weekly, so I am worried I might know some of the people. We do understand from the FAA confirming that three people were in the plane. All of them lost their lives. And like you were saying, you, you own a brewing company down the street. You work with a lot of these folks. You see a lot of these folks and you're concerned that you know the victims. Yeah, um, they're great people. They come down and visit last name. Um, our friend Andy owns it and um, you know it's it's tragic. I've seen a plane crash myself um, wow. at um, the airport in Fullerton so um, it's kind of life changing. It changes the way you look at flying when you see something like this. Absolutely. You were saying it felt like this massive explosion when you heard in the morning at 630 you came out of bed. We found you walking up the street because I know you were trying to look at what the commotion was all about. Did, did it feel like a earthquake or what did it feel like? I, I felt the ground actually shake. Yeah, wow. it, I, we have a few diesel trucks next door. So I mean, my thoughts were it was something like them hooking up a trailer or something, but it was extremely loud. And uh, yeah, my dad flies out of uh, out of uh, Apple Valley Airport and he lands here all the time. And we do occasionally see people come up short and a couple crashes here, but nothing this bad ever. It's really, really really bad. Kevin, I want to thank you for your time. I'm sorry about what's happened just up the street from you. A fire, the fire department says they have been able to put the fire out at the hangar. That's likely why we don't see a lot of flames in the background. It seems to be calm right now. They do say that the plane is in the hangar still and that the three people were found dead inside of the plane. We can see parts of the side of the wall. It's very difficult to see. I understand from this barbed wire, but we can see parts of the wall sticking out. So we know that something has happened there. We hope to get a closer look in the coming hours. But for now, I'll send it back to you both in the studios in Hollywood.